guys, you probably think I'm insane because I have long sleeves on, but my the office I work in is super cold. So that's why, but I wanted to show you, I'm wearing the new Bare Pro Foundation this morning. Also the new Bare Minerals Primer that's hydrating and the new contour. I'm going to have to do a full review on this to give you my thoughts, but I'll let you guys decide right now what you think of my skin and contour. I'm not going to say my opinion yet since I want to do a full review, but, and I literally have only had it on for about an hour now, but I just wanted to show you really quick and now I'm on my way to work. I just got home from PT, hurried up and got ready. And now on to work. But it is my birthday week and I'm so excited. So excited. I'm the kind of person that likes to celebrate the whole week long. So I really am trying to do like something kind of special every day. Whether it be like go get Starbucks. You know like small little things. Like get my free meals and stuff like that. So I will talk to you later. You guys words cannot express how bad my makeup looks today I don't know if you can see but it's breaking up around my nose and it broke up along my like jawline here I think it's just because it's so so hot here in Arizona that this foundation just did not work very well for me um it actually looks pretty good in camera possibly it still looks good the contour is magnificent I love it I know I was gonna do a separate review and I probably still will but I don't know. This is the first day I'm trying it out though, so I'll give it a fair chance. I'm going to get my nails done. No more mint. I'm going to do like a really, like a fair, like pink, like a really light pink with maybe like a rose gold glitter. Just very light dusting of that. They're my birthday nails, so I really want something classy and really perfect for my birthday. So I'll show you after I get them done. All right, guys, here are my birthday nails. They're just like a really light, like baby pink with rose gold glitter. And I just wanted like a really nice light layer of the glitter. And the color is DND, uh, what is it called? <laughs> I already forgot. Pink Beauty, that's what it's called. DND Gel Posh and Pink Beauty. And the glitter is called Pinky Diamond, I believe. And it's just straight like rose gold. Let me show you the other hand because I feel like it's prettier. I just feel like it's prettier because, you know, I don't know if my accident was on the other hand. I love them. They're very sparkly and very birthday appropriate for sure. Good morning, guys. It's Thursday. Only pretty much two full days of work because I just got to work right now before I get to celebrate all weekend. I'm so excited. So I wanted to share with you, I applied the foundation, sorry for the lighting. I applied the foundation today with the actual brush they sent me with the foundation and I already like it so much more. I feel like this foundation definitely changes by how you apply it. And I'm going to do a full review so I don't want to go into too much detail but um, I definitely like it a lot better and I used shade 4 instead of shade 2 today and I think it matches me a little bit better but we'll see if it oxidizes throughout the day. Um, shade 2 was just a little too yellow even though it was a bit neutral it just leaned more yellow. Um, same thing for this number 4 it even does still kind of lean a little bit more yellow and I'm I'm neutral. I'm like a neutral shade so my highlight though woo! I think it's number 13 one of the pigments from Makeup Forever. Yeah, I have the give, give on she or I'm still saying it wrong. Whatever, you get it. A blush from them, <laughs> and then I have my little Mickey studs today from Pan yeah from Pandora, and then I have my um, Disney Pandora bracelet on today. A lot of them are flipped around right now because I don't know. I just felt like wearing one of my Pandoras today, and I felt like the Disney ones most appropriate for a pediatric dental office. So that's why I wore it. My hair is like in a little side bun. I don't know if you can see it. See it back there? It's kind of tucked in the back today. All right, I'm going to get going because I have about two minutes before I need to check in for work. And I'll maybe see. You guys remember when I told you about these candles last week, the Charmed Aroma? So I've been burning this all week long. As you can see, it's about halfway done. This is the birthday cake one because... Obviously, I had to burn this one this week since it's my birthday, but this had a ring inside of it, and it was in this like little foil deep inside the candle here, 
and this is the ring that came out of it and it's definitely probably cubic zirconia because it's kind of huge but I think it's actually really pretty it's a size 7 and I'm usually a size 6 in rings so I'll probably end up maybe if I wear this it'll be on my middle finger because I don't want people thinking I'm engaged either because I'm obviously not but it's so pretty I like it a lot Hey guys, it's Friday. I'm so excited. So I have more of a full coverage foundation on today. Um, it's the L'Oreal, like the full coverage one. Can't think of the name. But I have Super Cindy on today, the Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. I just got my set from the Nortum Anniversary sale in. By the way, if you did not check out my haul yet, I'll have it linked down below. It's, it's the only beauty video for this week and I'm really sorry about that. I put this on Snapchat that I'm just super frustrated. I'm not going to get too much into it because I only have three minutes, so I have to be at work. But um, just super frustrated. I don't have enough time to do everything that I want to do for my channel anymore with having this job. And um, not that I don't like my job. It's just like it's really cutting at my time to dedicate to my channel. And I'm really sorry about that, guys. Um, by the way, I have my hair. I had it in a fishtail braid, and I kind of rolled it into a little bun on the side here. Um, because it just was super irritating me and I was like, I am not dealing with this all day. No way, Jose. I got some coffee and this is actually free birthday coffee from Dunkin' Donuts. It's um, iced mocha with skim milk and extra ice because I like it super cold. And I have like so many free things this weekend. Like I have free Starbucks coffee and free meal at Red Robin and free all over the place. Um, this is just like a sheer top. If you're wondering, I got it at a at Dolce, Dolce Salon and Spa. Like it's at a, their little boutique area there, so I can't tell you where it's from. Sorry, really. And I have little Kate Spade earrings on. They're actually matching today. <laughs> All right, I will see you guys later. Hey guys, so I've been rushing ever since I got back from work. So sorry I didn't vlog at home with my vlogging camera, vlogging on my iPhone. But we're on our way to see The Little Mermaid, and it's like a theater play though of the Little Mermaid at the Hale Theater in Gilbert. My stepdad actually got the tickets for me at, for Christmas and finally getting to see it so I'm really excited. I have this dress on that you guys have seen from Torrid before and I have like wedge booties on and leggings but you can't really see anything right now but just thought I'd say a quick hi and maybe I'll vlog a little bit later but If I look tired, it's because I am. <laughs> but I had a really great night, so we went to see The Little Mermaid at the Hale Theater. It was so good, you guys. Like, so professionally done. The costumes were amazing. The singing was insanely good. Acting was great. Like, if you live in Arizona, I believe The Little Mermaid play is going on till mid-August at the Hale Theater. If you live in Gilbert or if you're willing to drive, if you're in Phoenix or something like that, I would definitely suggest it. Really, really good. And because the theater, I think I showed maybe a small clip, the, the actual stage area is in the center of the theater. So every all the seats surround it and they continuously like bring in new props like throughout it, but they do it so seamlessly. It was so good, I loved it. And then we went to, Cheesecake Factory for dinner for like a early birthday dinner and I had some really yummy pasta but I took like two-thirds of it home because didn't eat for a while and you know how when you at least this is how it happens for me when you haven't eaten for a long period of time and then you're like starving and you eat you get full so much faster so weird but it was really really good I'm gonna show you a really sweet gift that I received too tonight so, so apparently I'm a very lucky girl because they <laughs> showed up with 24 red roses that are absolutely stunning and these chocolates, which I've never tried before, but I'm very curious about them. Do you guys like these? I know my stepdad would love them because he loves toffee. 
I don't think my dentist will approve. <laughs> but it's so, so thoughtful. And they're so beautiful. I still have to um, trim them and give them some flower food. What is this? You know, like this stuff. But just wanted to show you guys how pretty they are. So I just finished arranging them. Literally, it's midnight. Actually, oh my lord, it's almost one o'clock. But I couldn't sleep till I finished arranging them because I'm such a weirdo. I think they look so pretty. I love roses, they're so pretty. Hey guys, so I'm rushing because the guys are about to pick me up um, to go out tonight for my birthday, but I wanted to share with you, I know this is very boobalicious, but this is a free people dress that I have on. See, it's really pretty. It has like the lace detail on the sides and in the middle. And I curled my hair. My hair is not the best. <laughs> Unfortunately, I didn't get a blowout like I wanted to today. So it's a little bit of a hot mess, as am I. But I did get lash extensions today. And I really love them thanks to my good friend Amy. If you're in Arizona, I will leave her info down below. But I need to get going because I need to put my booties on and put some jewelry on. Okay, not the most flattering of angles, but I have no makeup on, zero makeup on right now. I wanted to show you guys my lash extensions up close. Let me go to the side so you can kind of see. They are so beautiful. I really, really love them. Um, only thing is, I don't know if I would continue to get them done um, because... You know when you put, those of you that wear lashes at times, fake lashes, you know you always put those on last because they get in the way if you're going to put them on before you do your eye makeup. So I feel like they get in the way a little bit. If you're someone that doesn't wear a lot of makeup though, and you just want to always look put together, I think lash extensions are a really good option. Um, I don't know. I might get one fill and see how I like it, but I do like waking up looking pretty damn fabulous <laughs> with your lashes on, you know? Um, okay, so I'm just doing a very minimal makeup look today, and I thought I'd chit-chat with you guys since I did not vlog at all yesterday, like last night, and I'm going to see if my friend um, Ernie will give me some of the footage that he took at the bar. We went to, I don't even remember the name bar's name. Hold on. Forget what it's called. It is called... Uh, it's called Valley Bar. It's in downtown Phoenix. If you're from Arizona. My battery's flashing at me already, so I might not be able to get through this whole thing. <laughs> um, but it was fun because it was 80s night, so they had like all 80s music and... Um, they were playing 80s movies, like, in the background, and it was packed, though, and it was so hot. It's actually probably better I didn't vlog, because I looked, well, it was dark anyways, you probably wouldn't have been able to see. Um, but I looked horrible by the end of it. I was, like, a wreck by the end of it. <laughs> Sweaty mess, like, I came home and showered instantly. That's how much of a wreck I was, but... We had a really good time, so thanks to who came out with me. My friend Joan came too. Thank you, Joan, if you're watching, for coming. And it was fun, like, getting to hang out with her too. So, yeah, we had a really good time. And now I'm going to go to lunch with Mama Bee. And I'm going to do a really minimal makeup look, though. Where is that? I've been using this BB cream, this, like, little sample size. It's the Luna SPF 25 PA++. Um, I believe it's a Korean brand BB cream, and I really, really like it. It's it's a little bit glowy, but not really. Look, I am like literally having to squeeze this to death because none wants to come out. It's a little on the yellow side for me, but I make it work. I think I squeezed a little too much, so we're going to put some underneath. <laughs> um, so yeah, what else did I want to tell you? We also watched the UFC fights last night before we went out. We went to my friends Sadie and Raylan's. Um, and we got to see their new house, which is beautiful. 
in Phoenix watching the fights. That's why we ended up going there instead of like Tempe or Scottsdale. But I'm going to be having an eventful the next two weekends because I'm going to a wedding next week. Um, so I feel like the vlog might end up being late again next week. I'm so sorry, you guys. It'll be like three weeks in a row that it'll, it'll be up late. Um, hopefully you don't mind. I mean, I know that it's part of your Sunday routine usually, but I was going to try to make it work, but I don't know. I just can't make any promises for next weekend either. Um, with the wedding being on Sunday. So we will see if I can get that edited on Saturday night, depending on what I'm doing with my friend Trisha, because I'm going to be staying with Trisha from A Glittery Life. You guys know her. If you've watched my channel for a while, she's been on my channel a couple times. I've spoken about her many a time. She is a good friend. So you will see her next week too. And we're going to do just so much fun stuff. I'm really excited. I have off for my birthday tomorrow. When I'm filming this, it's Sunday. Um, I have off for my birthday. By the way, this highlight I'm putting on my cheeks, I've been using this liquid highlight from NARS in Illuminor. I think that's how you say it. It's so beautiful. I've been liking the extra kind of glow and dew to the skin, but not oily looking, you know? I'm going to do a little teeny bit of concealer because Lord knows I was up late last night. I'm not hungover though. Victory, mini victory. <laughs> I didn't drink that much though. I think I had three drinks. So over the span of like hours. So um, didn't go too crazy. <clears throat> oh, I, I was going to tell you what I'm doing today. So I'm going to lunch with Mama Bee. By the way, this is the it cut not it cosmetics. This is the Born This Way concealer from Too Faced. Okay, so we're going to lunch. I don't know where yet. And then Mama Bee said she has a surprise birthday gift that I have to pick out. So I have no clue what she's talking about. So obviously, we're, I'm going to take you guys along with us. I wish I had vlogged yesterday some more because we went shopping, Mama V and I, and I will try and show you that before the end of this vlog, what I ended up purchasing. I would do it in a separate video, but I can't trust myself to remember to do that, <laughs> to make a separate video on what I, like, purchased. One of the things was the Free People dress that I showed you guys last night that I wore. Um, I got that at Buckle, which Buckle is one of my favorite stores ever. Um... So yeah, we went to Buckle, I went to Torrid, I went to Charlotte Russe, which I haven't gone to Charlotte Russe in forever, and they have some cute things for really inexpensive. Um, and then I got a pair of shoes at Kohl's, which I did show you last night. So, did, did some birthday shopping with Mama B yesterday, and then we got our toes done too, which I think I did maybe show you a small clip of that. And... Yeah, it's been a really fun weekend so far. I'm really enjoying myself. I'm really not trying to get too preoccupied about turning 30. Um, see, it's so difficult for me to put my anything on my eyes with those lashes. Because I don't want to like get the lashes messed up. So, I guess maybe I just can't use my fingers anymore. I need to start using brushes for all applications so I can get real into this area. But anyways, and what I was saying was, I'm trying not to get too preoccupied about turning 30. It's going to be my dirty 30. <laughs> I keep saying that because it makes me laugh. And I, I don't know. I love that phrase. It's hilarious. And I'm going to make it everything that it should be and more. It's going to be a good year, guys. It's going to be such a good year. By the way, I have a giveaway coming up in about a week. So if you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. Who's texting me? You better be sending me those videos. Hold on. They're all of the music playing. Oh my god, you're so stupid. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Oh my god, really? Hey guys, Mama B's with me. Hi everyone! Woo woo! <laughs> <laughs> and we're on our way to go to Red Robin. It's so humid though. I'm like dying of sweat oh, already. So humid. Oh my lord. But we're going to Red Robin because I have a free like birthday meal. So that's kind of exciting. Oh yeah. Oh, I have to tell you about this lipstick though. Becca just sent me my first ever PR package from Becca and I was so so excited. It's Let's like a birthday present Becca. for Becca. Woo woo Becca. 
<laughs> okay, Mama be also excited, I guess. And it was like literally getting a birthday present from Becca, getting that package today. So they have new lipsticks that are coming out and this is one of them. It's so pretty, I'm gonna tell you what the actual shade is. I feel like my voice is kind of crappy. Not really. Anyways. <laughs> I'll talk to you All guys. Party last I'll night. talk to you guys when I get I read. Just kidding. I am coming back on here because I want to show you the actual packaging for the Becca lipstick. Look at this, isn't it cool? It's pretty. And it says Becca at the top here, and there's you can see the lipstick color through the top there. And this is the color. So this is ginger vanilla that I have on right now, and they're called the Lush Lip Color Bombs. And are they creamy? They are super soft like silk oh, wow. when you put them on your lips. And I think it's because it's kind of like a bomb texture. And yeah, nice. so far so good. I guess mama be stealing one. Yeah, for sure after <laughs> I swatch them. <laughs> you guys, I'm so predictable. This is what I had, I got chicken with my buzz sauce. This stuff is Spicy and ranch. Mama B got a burger. Dang right. It's birthday weekend, so I'm just going for it. So this just happened, you guys. Ah, I'm so excited. This is my birthday present this year. Just went to Best Buy with Mama B. It was a complete surprise, and I wasn't planning on getting this, but. Very excited, I got the MacBook Pro Silver. It's the 15 inch. It does not have the side, the like little bar finger scroll thing at the top that's brand new to Apple. I just didn't think that was necessary. It was more money to get that, so I decided not to. I went with the MacBook Pro because it's better for editing um, higher resolution video, which is what I like to do. So hopefully, if I get this all set up today, I will be editing this vlog on this laptop. I'm so excited. I have so much to set up on it, but, so I got that, and then I also got an external hard drive, a two um, terabyte, so that I have extra storage as well. But yes, I'm so excited. So, this lighting is kind of poor, but I want to show you what I got yesterday when I went shopping. And I also wanted to show you the Becca package. <sighs> I'm so excited, you guys. So this is from Becca. And I still have the lipstick on. I have not retouched it and I ate. It's kind of like when you first put it on, it's very creamy, but it's kind of more a matte formula as it dries down. Um, I'm not sure if it's meant to be, so let's see. It says, nude isn't a shade, it's a feeling. Romantic, bold, subtle, sexy. Discover your Becca Lush Lip Nude Mood. So these are all nude lipsticks. And it says, nourishing, low maintenance lip color. Everyone is craving ultra creamy and luxuriously lightweight. I agree with the lightweight. It is so creamy, it is so lightweight. The buildable color enhances your lips with customizable coverage. Free of sulfates, parabens, and phylates. Has a hoba oil in it to hydrate. They're $22 a piece. So it doesn't say anything about what the finish is supposed to be, but initially when I put it on, it has a slight like creamy glossiness to it, very slight, like, and as it wears down, it becomes more of like a matte, like I have on right now. So like I said before, I have ginger vanilla on, but there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight colors, and this is how the package came. So those are all the shades and I most likely will wear these four the most. <laughs> these are a little bit darker. Oh, don't fall out on me. Chai cream, oh, that sounds like a pretty one. So like I showed you guys the packaging earlier, but here's like what the actual like box packaging looks like. Um, so the packaging itself, it is like a clear see-through and you can see the bullet through it. You can see the color through the top. Um, it is like a plastic. It does securely close really well. Um, I like the packaging, but for $22, it might not be super luxurious in my opinion, but the actual like mechanism to twist the lipstick up and down is really nice and smooth. You know, I sometimes have issue like with NYX and like really lower end lipsticks not having that smoothness, so that's important to me. I'm gonna try this one on with you guys over the top. That's pretty, it's a pretty fall nude for me. This one is the, what's it called again? 
chai cream. But I kind of have it over the top of the other one, but that's very pretty. Yeah, it's such a creamy formula. It is super lightweight. Mama B tried it on too, and she said, I, I obviously didn't read this to her, and she said, wow, these are really lightweight, <laughs> or that they don't feel like anything. That's what she said, and it's really true. All right, shopping trip. So the other thing I got a buckle, this is buckle. Um, you already saw the free people dress that I wore for my birthday, like outing yesterday. But I also got this top, it's a little wrinkled now, um, from the brand Day Trip from Buckle. And I just thought this would be a nice one for work. Um, the sides are a little bit longer. It's super flattering on. It's like a nice stretchy, lightweight material. And it has that keyhole in the front and back. And it's such a soft material, it's really, really cute on. So I love that. Then like I said, I did go to Charlotte Russe as well. So I'll insert a picture because I took one in the dressing room. But I got this little, what's this, crop top. And I love the color of this. It has like the crisscross detail in the front. It has this little detail in the back. Love the color. It's so soft and comfortable. And I actually got this in a medium because it runs a little big. So just so you know. I got that in a medium. I got this top from Buckle and Extra Large. The Free People dress that I wore yesterday is a medium. Free People can sometimes run a bit big, so just keep that in mind. I was a medium in that. This little like top, I guess you would call it a top. It's like kind of like a top kimono kind of style. This is Extra Large. See, like just depends on the make of the shirt. But this is so flowy and beautiful. Look at the sleeves. It has that kind of bell detail sleeve. It's very feminine. It ties in the front and it goes pretty long. And I'll, sh I'll insert a picture so you guys can get the full gist of it. I think I'm gonna wear this on my actual birthday tomorrow. And then at Charlotte Russe, it was buy one get one 50% off plus I had $20 off um, because I had $10 off coupon for my birthday and $10 rewards. And Mama B actually got me these clothes from Torrid for my birthday. I feel like she also bought the pair of shoes for me that I wore yesterday for my birthday. Okay, so this top, Mama would be spotted. And it goes really perfect with the other piece that I ended up picking up. So this is like a really nice olive green top with black lace details, very flowy. And I got, I think I got all of my stuff in double zero this time, um, which is essentially a 12, I believe in regular sizing. Okay, then this army jacket, you guys, I have been looking for a really cute flattering army jacket forever and I finally found one at Torrid. And this just came out for fall and actually this one's in a zero, not a double zero. So this is what it looks like. I'll have to do a try on at some point. This is what it looks like. It cinches in, there's like a, see these little ties right here? It cinches in your waist a little bit so it's really flattering and it has these patches on the side, which I love. And it's a really nice lightweight jacket. And it goes pretty long too, I love it. Love, love, love that. Then, okay, so this is technically a nighty, but I was almost gonna wear it for my birthday yesterday. Um, don't judge me. Like obviously I was gonna wear something underneath this sheer part right here. Um, and I was gonna wear leggings with it, but this is so beautiful. So it goes around the neck here, and then it's like a lace cutout all around like the boob area. And then this is sheer right here. And then it has some lace detail on the bottom. But it really does look like a top in my opinion, especially when I have it on. Um, as long as you have like a bandeau or something covering your chest, obviously. So it's super pretty. I would wear it as a nighty or a shirt out. And then I got this top for work. This is part of their new fall line as well. Just a really nice lightweight top. Has like little cute little cut sleeves there. Buttons up, it has little black stars on it. I'm not sure you can tell, there you go. Really cute. All right, that's all I got. Seriously, I'm just showing you guys this because just to prove to you that I'm not, my house is not always perfectly clean. This is my, in my kitchen area. <laughs> And I have all the stuff just sitting out here and it's really because I need to do I need to do a haul for you guys This is like 
haul. This backpack is part of my giveaway. This is my cake topper for tomorrow for my actual birthday. And then these are things that just need to be put away that I just showed you. So that this is this to me is a ridiculous mess. Like it's making me have anxiety. But I just wanted to quickly hold on. I just wanted to quickly say thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all the birthday wishes. I love you guys so much. You mean the world to me and just having you say happy birthday makes my day. I'm seeing all your messages. If I don't get a chance to respond to everyone, please know that I am reading them and I love them and I appreciate them very greatly. And I'm so excited about my computer, you guys. I just finished editing, or almost ed finished editing because I'm gonna post this with the vlog, but I've never gotten done editing so quickly. It's 10 o'clock, I maybe took an hour to edit. Usually it takes me a couple hours, and the processing time is ridiculously quick. I'm just blown away right now. I am blown away, and I can't believe I've been like struggling t with editing for the last five years or four and four or five years with this la with my old laptop, which I still have her. I didn't give her away. She's gonna still be in the family. <laughs> but yeah, for editing, it's gonna be all on my MacBook Pro and I'm obsessed. I love it so much. <laughs> so much best birthday gift ever. So my actual birthday footage will be on next week's vlog, so be sure to check that out. Subscribe if you're new. Please stick around to watch more videos, 